On one of the faces of this cube, I have drawn a simple sketch. Suppose that I need to copy this sketch over to another face of the cube. Right clicking on the sketch does not give you the option to copy. Selecting the sketch, pressing Ctrl C and then selecting a new surface and pressing Ctrl V does not work either. We have to go inside the sketch and select the entities. So let's right click on the sketch in the browser and go to edit sketch. Before we select the entities, let's take a while to understand the dimensions. These are the dimensions that define the length of the entities. While these two dimensions govern the position of the entities with respect to the origin. We shall see whether these dimensions get transferred later during the copying process. You can window select from left to right, making sure to encompass all entities. Or you can double click on one entity to select the whole chain. After selection, press Ctrl C. Exit the sketch and create a sketch on the new surface. At this point, press Ctrl V. The move copy command comes up. The dimensions controlling the length of the entities are preserved. But the position with respect to the origin did not carry over. I will press OK to leave it in the default location and define the position myself. Let's change this dimension and see whether it affects the original sketch. You can see that the original sketch remains unaffected. Let's undo this change. And repeat this on the original sketch. The copied sketch is not affected. So the copied sketch is completely independent from the original sketch.